vectors in three space R3. Quadrilateral ABCD has vertices A minus 3, 4, minus 1, B 5, 0, 3, C 12, minus 2, minus 2, and D as 4, 2, minus 6. Show that ABCD is a parallelogram. Now, we will use matrix to solve this problem. Let's first sketch the, let's first sketch a quadrilateral. So, let me just draw randomly. And I'm trying to make it a parallelogram itself so that it's not far uh, from what we're trying to achieve. Now, let's see. Let's say these are the points A. So, A is minus 3, 4, minus 1. And here we have B, which is 5, 0, 3. And then we have C, which is 12, minus 2, minus 2. And then D, which is 4, 2, minus 6. Now, these are the points so we are given vertices of a quadrilateral the vertices are vertices are a b c and d now to prove that this quadrilateral is a parallelogram we should prove that a b is parallel to dc and is also equal to dc similarly we have to prove that DA is parallel to CB and is equal to CB. Only if the opposite sides are parallel and equal that a quadrilateral will become a parallelogram. So let's figure out what is AB. So AB is equal to, so we'll use matrix to find AB. So we'll subtract all respective direction numbers from B to A. So what we will do is we will do x2 minus x1, y2 minus y1, z2 minus z1 to get AB. So AB is 5 minus minus 3, 0 minus 4, and 3 minus minus 1. And that gives us 5 minus minus 3 is 8. And here we have 4, and this is 4. So we have 8, or oh, 0, 0 min, minus 4. It's not this, one, plus 4, it's minus 4. Sorry. So that is 4 here. So that is AB for us. And now we can find what is AB should be parallel to DC. So let's find what is DC. So we have DC is equals to. 12 minus 4 minus 2 minus 2 minus 2 minus 6 minus 6 so that is 12 minus 4 is 8 minus 2 minus 2 is minus 4 and minus 2 plus 6 will be plus 4 so you can clearly see that AB is equal to DC. So both vectors are exactly same. That means they have same magnitude and same direction. So that is how we can say that AB is parallel to DC and they are equal. Now we need to prove how about DA and CB. So D to A will be when we say D to A then we'll do minus 3, minus 4, 4, minus 2, minus 1, minus of minus 6. Minus 3, minus 4 is minus 7, 4 minus 2 is 2, and minus 1 plus 6 will be plus 5. Now, D to A should be compared with C to B. So what is C to B? C to B is equal to, when we say C to B, it is x2 minus x1, y2 minus y1, z2 minus z1. That is the vector CB. So 5 minus 12, 
0 minus minus 2, 3 minus minus 2. 5 minus 12 is minus 7 and 0 minus minus 2 is plus 2 and 3 minus minus 2 is 5. So you can see that dA is equals to CB, right? So dA is equals to CB. Since these two vectors are equal, that means their direction is same and their magnitude is also same. Now since the opposite sides are equal in length and we have two set of parallel lines here, this quadrilateral is a parallelogram, correct? So that is how we can prove this kind of question. Thank you.